Hi, I'm John. And I'm Ted. I'm here. <laughs> and welcome back to Awesome Quest. And I would like to emphasize how vehemently I disagree with John's statement at the very end of the last episode that Dark Souls sucks. I just, I get frustrated real easy. Yeah. Because <laughs> <'cause laughs> I am enjoying playing the game. Like, don't get me wrong. I am it's, having fun. It's so funny to think about that. I so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back and do what Sam suggested. Okay. So just you can just run by those guys. Just don't let them drop on you. Just run. There is. And then a, kill him before he turns back. Yeah. There's a YouTube video I saw. Yeah. Um, it's a guy for Kotaku, and yes, I know everybody hates Kotaku, but I like this guy, Tim Rogers. Mm. Um, he did a well, top ten yeah. games of the this decade, mm -hmm. and he decided. Um, Dark Souls was number one for a lot of different reasons, but good because good historically call. it changed how a lot of games are. Yeah, recently and now you will have to go through that area with the dogs in the water and both butchers. Yep. No, the butchers don't respond. Oh, they don't respond. That's right. So, what's over on this side? It's where oh, the pyromancer was. Yeah. So you just have dogs in the water. And dogs on land. And a hollow. Those aren't too bad. It's mainly the dogs. Like I said, we're gonna go to um the area called the Undead Asylum again before we do Blight Town. I would say I would at least get the ring from that area, because that'll help you get through the swamps and Blight Town a lot quicker. Because the poison swamps in Blight Town have this same water effect that causes you to slow down. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's super soft. And there is a ring that prevents you from moving like this. Nice, it got stuck on the geometry. I was able to take advantage of it. Mm -hmm. I do believe there will be more dogs up here. At least one more. Okay, so from here, there is a bunch of boxes behind that table. Okay. Roll. See? Is it just a fall hole? Yeah, just yes. fall. It's not as deep as it looks. <laughs> and now you can just spam magic on him. There's Riveting also, there's gameplay! Also, um, I believe there's also a shield and an armor set up here, so don't drop down right away. Gotcha. The spider shield, I believe, is the one up here. The spider shield's good because it blocks a little bit of magic, right? No. Poison. It <laughs> help. It uh, increases your threshold before you get poisoned. Yeah. And he's gone forever, by the way. I ate him. Okay, so... Yeah, over there. Okay. So you're gonna want to go around. Oh, gotcha. I only got a thousand souls for killing that. Yeah. Lame. I mean, he's he's a not rat. that strong, and he's a rat exactly. Now, the royal rat. Uh, no, that's a Dark Souls two reference, and even I don't get Dark Souls two because I've not played it yet. You haven't? No. No, oh, I thought. Nope. Spider shield. I'm a fake Dark Souls fan, Sam. <laughs> Just like, I'm a fake Dark Souls fan. Like, you're a fake JoJo fan. Oh, wait, yeah, that's it. Now, check your role after you put that on, by the way. Yeah, it's gonna be heavy. the episode title, Ted is a fake Dark Souls fan. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah it's you're a back down to medium. That medium, actually. If you want, drop down. So how can I, how can I abate that? Your, your speed? No, my role. Level endurance. Mm -hmm. Level endurance? Pump endurance, yeah. Okay. Just pump it. Now. Don't fall down that- don't. Left. To your left, and then go down. And then go down even further Hug left. Hug the wall. Hug the wall, yeah. Wall is your friend. There we go. And there is a shortcut to the bonfire in this area. Okay. So, just ignore the slimes. No, but if don't. I want the free experience... Oh, yeah. And they might drop, drop large t Titanite shards, so... 
I thought they dropped, like, green types. That is the slugs, I believe. And I think oh. the slugs can also drop large. Oh, at the bottom of... Yeah. Like, yeah. um... That's, that's where you find large type. Yeah. Because they have a higher... Dro These guys have a 2% chance, and the slugs have 5.5. So where do I need to go? Not that way. Um, turn. There. Follow It'll lead the to the bonfire. Because you're almost to the boss. Oh boy! I'm only a little scared. Like now. Wait. Recognize where you are? Barely. Um, Go back up there. Oh yeah, the, it's up here. The so beauty of Dark Souls. So you've just opened up a shortcut. Okay. So if you don't want to sit, I wouldn't sit because you haven't used any Estus and you're completely at full health. Okay. Unless, Sam, would you say he has a level or two in him? I have one. One level, yeah. You do what you want. I'm gonna level up my endurance. And again, it won't be an immediate, like, you won't be able to roll. Yeah. I don't think. But endurance is always good to get. Yep. Hmm. That is a faster roll. Good goodbye, floating cheese balls. Okay. So you'll also meet a merchant in this general area. He's a cool guy. Hi, Shamai. Hi, Shamai. I think that's what he says. It's a Welsh greeting, I think. But I have to ask Maggie. She's been to Wales. Yeah. Baby also, sister. Also, the basilics are right around that. Cor you know that corridor to the left. That you saw? Yeah. That's where the basilisks are. So don't go that way. Yeah. It's also where Kirk would invade. Would be right around here. Possibly closer to the basilisks. Should I? You're not human. You won't Should invade. I get the humanity? If That's you want. That's your choice. Kirk is pretty tough. Then no. <laughs> ha! Jesus. Remember though, John, what he's doing, he's doing for a good purpose. No, not that. I literally almost had a slime drop on my head. No, we were talking about that slime. <laughs> yeah, the slime has a good reason for dropping on you, John. Yeah. You ever it's, think it's about to eat you? You ever think about that lone crab in the um in the catacombs of Carthus, and how it's trying to join the skeleton club, and because it's an exoskeleton, it probably can, and that's why it starts attacking you immediately because you're not part of. the Are there skeleton more club. slimes on oh, the ceiling? Deep. I yeah. can't see. And then there's Maybe. that one slime in Carthus that... Oh. I don't know. What a drop. Ah, Green Titanite, okay. Yeah, I was right. I'm a genius. The slugs also drop it, too. Green Titanite is for magic? I can't remember. Me neither. Is it for lightning? So, John. Through there is the way to Blighttown. However, there's a guy to talk to. Kill that monster first, the rat, though. But he's Not trying the guy. to run away from me. Yeah. Oh, well, if it's trying to run away, then it's trying to lead you into something. Because the boss fight is basically just down there. And now that you've killed the channeler, you don't have to worry about it getting buffed. And if you do go human, you could, in theory, fight Kirk and also summon help, but its HP values is just too high. Yeah, this boss is not... Not worth it going, human, going and summoning someone for... It's like... a terrible strategy, Yeah, actually. okay. Like, and also, don't buy his stuff right now, because he gives you stuff that breaks really quickly. Okay. And guess what this boss does? Breaks things? Yep. The, this vomit breaks stuff. Oh, I didn't know that. It's, it's why it's so mean that he sells crystal stuff here. Oh. This guy's a cool guy, though. Yeah. He somehow gets all the boss armor. <laughs> yeah. And then sells it to you. Yeah, after you kill bosses, he finds their armor. And then... Alright. And he's not even a dick to you for not buying anything. Um. So, yeah. Go fight the boss. Which, that's Blight Town, by the way. Oh. The boss is down in the area you just went into. So, uh, so I have to go up here to fight the boss. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, go go in there and then go down. And then you'll you... get the key to Blight Town. Yeah. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Which is why, if you don't have the master key, this fight is mandatory. Other way. 
You're too fat. <laughs> yeah. I love I love the passive aggressive soapstone messages for areas like that where it looks like it's an area over there and then they say like try or like nice try fatty or something <laughs> like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Dark Souls. Or try running fatty. So there was <laughs> nothing like over that. here and I yeah. just wasted time. Okay. There is an item to pick up around here, but I think it's down the next in the next, like, floor. Yeah, it's worth it to explore a bit. Yeah. Because down there is the boss. Alright, open heart surgery, dragon. Here we go. Yeah, heavy crossbow and heavy bolts. And you do have to activate it through a cutscene, by the way. Gotcha. Three, two, one. Do Here it. Here we go. You big man. Oh, boss. wait, no, it just happens automatically. I forgot that you didn't have to walk up to the bottomless pit it crawls out of. Look at it, it's so cute. God, I love that. It's so crazy, the design. <laughs> Hello, everyone, I'm the Open Heart Surgery Dragon. What's Stick. the lore on this thing? I think it is actually an ancient dragon, an ancient stone dragon that got corrupted somehow. I'm not sure. It just wants to eat. I know it's not a drake, it actually is a dragon. I think. It might be a drake. Okay, so you were about to give me advice. I wasn't. Beat the boss. Yeah. You said stick something. Okay. I don't remember saying stick anything, did I? I don't remember. I don't remember either. <laughs> His whole body is a hitbox, by the way. So I get hit no matter where I'm at. Just when, about. when he's doing that. When he's yeah. doing that in particular, that charge. Um, hitting his head is mo does the most damage. Uh, but? Yeah, but he charges you and he has a vomit attack and he jumps in the air. So, so keeping track of where he is is annoying. When he jumps up in the air. Well, that sucked. Don't worry, that's how everyone's first attempt goes on that guy. The spider shield has a pretty good defense rating, though, right? I believe it's 100%. Maybe not quite 100. Check. Go into equipment. Press. Uh, X. No, press, um, press... Press B again, then press Y. It is 100% physical reduction, yes. Oh, okay. Exit the menu. There we go. Don't yell at me. I'm just a boy. I'm just a boy. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. You need? Do you need no sympathy? I got that reference. Uh oh. <laughs> I, I I made a joke last night. Yeah. Where, um, oh, what was it? Oh, someone said like, guess what, chicken butt. And yeah. All I said was I got that reference. <laughs> <laughs> so just saying I got that reference to just like something dumb Random. that it doesn't mean anything. I thought it was funny. Yeah, that's that's pretty okay. good. If you want, you can skip the cutscene. How? Press plus. Yeah. Now, Sam, would you say to lock on or not on this guy? Nah, it's yeah. not worth it. And remember, you can sprint to get around. Yeah. You can cut off his tail, also. I would say it's not worth it, oh, though. Oh, you got eaten. Yeah! Mm. He grabbed you. Yeah. death? Probably. No! But one hit and you're done. Yep. There it is. Sprinti sprinting is very important because he takes yeah. up a lot of space and you don't want to be in his space. Uh, Get out of my space, guys. I'm going to smash you if you are. Stupid light. <sighs> oh, yeah. Playing Dark Souls in the dark are the absolute best. Yeah. And then we'll all go blind because we can't see anything. Especially if we go to um the d d demon ruins. Oh, that would hurt. I oh the um the flame the falling city of falling flame and code of vein, that was bad. 
That was bad. That wasn't too bad. The, the, it was bright. It was too bright for me. It was like, the, eh. Also, the um, Cathedral of the Sacred Blood was just blindingly white. That was an annoying novel. I haven't played that since I stayed at Ted's house to record. Yeah. That is a game I would love to play again. Like, not necessarily on the show, but just to play, because it's it it really is super fun. Mm -hmm. And they added height sliders just now, just a couple days ago. Nice. Yeah. The fact that that wasn't included in the base game was kind of confusing. Yeah. I will. I, that's for that's my opinion, but like. I agree with you. On that one. So at least this is a, pr a pretty dang short run, right, John? Yeah. And it's pretty easy, too. Now, if you have... You do have some Lightning Pine Resin that could be used. Because he is a dragon, and that does extra damage. Okay. But it's expensive, and, you know, it's expensive. <laughs> yeah. So sprint, don't target, just deal damage. Let's go. And remember, hit when he does that charge thing, everything becomes a hitbox. And there is a bottomless pit at the very end of that of the stage. See, now he's charging forward. You can always keep enough stamina to run and or dodge. Cause he's jumping up. Oh, wait, no, he's gonna slam down. Or not. He's reared back to the slam down. And or puke. Charging again. Mm -hmm. Okay, my magic has run out. Yeah. On my sword. Again, it's not. It wasn't. It was making a, a good difference, but not <sighs> the best difference. Yeah, not enough to be like. Nice. Because he's just big and has a lot of HP. And again, he's added to the list of, why can't I normally be- Okay, run. Okay, never mind, he didn't slam down. Because this is another one to add to the list of, why can't I beat this dragon? Because it's horribly mutated. <laughs> Wait, is, you mean, why can't why, I, why I beat can this I beat dragon? The dragon? Yeah, sorry. Ah, oh, dang it. At least it didn't grab you. Yeah. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Om nom 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 nom. Honestly, that's the that's the slam I was talking about that he looked like he was gonna do. This fight just mostly takes a while. It, yeah. Once you know how to beat it, you know how to beat it. Yeah, and I I see that it's actually kind of a simple fight. Like, mm -hmm. ultimately, you it's just, just kind of like, kind of a battle of attrition. Yeah, it's like it's it's it follows the old I think it's uh, Total Biscuit method of Dark Souls, which is bury face in ass and swipe at knees. Yeah. That's basically it for this guy. He does puke have vomit that, you know, destroys your equipment. Yeah. I don't know if you got the repair box. I did. Okay, good. Then, we're, then you're pretty well off, even if you have stuff happen. Okay, so that was the slam. Mm-hmm. Again, because he's, he's so big, it's hard to tell what he's doing. Yeah. Now he's going to fly up. Punch down. <laughs> oh, that hit. Yeah. He has ridiculous hitboxes. Now he's going to charge, which means I just need to catch up to him. I'm glad you're taking the keep a little bit of stamina thing to heart. Um, here's another thing. You can just two-hand your yeah. sword because you're not going to be using your shield at all. Oh, yeah. Get a little extra damage that way. Yeah, ro rolling is not the best in this fight. In fact, either. It's mostly just run. Yeah. 
Because he's so big and rolling doesn't cover enough space in as much t in as little time as you have. Gotcha. Nice. Dragon King, great axe. Now he can't do that tail swipe attack either yep. at you. See, nice. he tried. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah, his little butt wag now. I do believe if you die, you will have to do that again, though. Yeah, he will regrow the tail, but you can't. Oh, he's puking, attack. by the way. Like, stay away. That it covers a lot. Oh, Jesus! It's a lot of area, yeah. Did I get hit? Yeah, but it doesn't destroy things immediately. It's more for if you bought the crystal stuff that it would have been an issue. Gotcha. Because it has all of, like, what, like, 20 or 40 endurance on the crystal weapons? That's crazy. It's, it's mean that they give you those weapons to buy right there. Right before a boss that can destroy them. Artorius, I think, also has a move that will cause your, um, weapons to break. Like the corrosion of the abyss up. kind of thing. Slam down. Get over to his side. Oh, he's gonna walk. Mm hmm. Yep. yep. And we'll go over time on this episode. Oh, yeah, like. definitely. Because I'll, I'll admit, I think. I And this is a big think. I think I've got it for the most part. Yeah, he's not too tough, honestly. He's just a you long just need, fight. You just need to learn how to play the fight. And he's okay, barfing. he's gonna barf. Yeah. I'd say you're good here. Because remember, there is a bottomless pit at the yeah, end of this. You don't want to keep charging forward. Because you will. Forward. Yeah, you will. Uh... And he's gonna slam, and then he's gonna sprint. Yeah, so probably. I'm get around him. Because I was far enough away that I think you I figured out. You don't want to get, out. like, two behind him, because you want to be able to get an attack when he's uh... Yeah. God, this is so much better than I did back when I was playing through this game the first time. <laughs> well, I mean, I have help. Like, you guys are literally telling me, like, hey, this is probably your best bet. He's going to slam down. And again, big enemies like this, like Sam is saying, big enemies like this are, are uh -huh. better to not lock onto. He tried to whack me with yeah. his tail. -y. His stub. Shaking that fat ass. Not quite as fat as the Asylum Demon, though. Asylum Demon is thick. <laughs> the thickest boy. Or girl, whichever one the Asylum Demon is. We don't like to judge here. We don't like to assume here, excuse me. Wrong word. <laughs> Slam. Nice. Thank you. Oops. Ooh. Yeah. Oof. It All is right. a lot of damage. It's a very big, beefy boy. Yeah, I'll admit that hurt a lot. Oh. No, you'll be fine still. It'll be close, though. Yeah. Now he's vomiting. Yeah, that's the direction. And then, yeah. Over here. Mm -hmm. Trying to not get too close to him. He's yeah. moving because when he's moving. One, two, three, four. We are gonna go way over time today, guys. <laughs> I apologize, but like this is a war of attrition. Uh, I tried to get out of there. Gonna Not barf again. Might as well use your last SS. That's what I was gonna do. Slam down. Get on his side. I also remember using uh, pine resin for this yeah, fight the, the just to make pine. it go quicker. <laughs> yeah, I can see why you would. Because this is a dragon. He's weak to lightning. Four. 
one. Yeah! I was like, yes, please uh, commit. Just get it. <laughs> Don't proud of you, John. Thank you. Well, everybody... Uh, we'll call that an episode. We will see you guys in the next one. Did I get only no... Did I get no souls? No, wait, wait. It'll yeah, show no. up. It'll happen. It'll happen. Somewhere. Okay. There we go. 25,000. Holy shit. So if well, you want to use a homeward bone, use a homeward bone. We will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.